Hello my friends, I hope you're having a lovely day, and in today's video we are checking out Void Bastards, which is such a fun name to say. Uh, Void Bastards, yes, it comes to the Switch uh, soon. We're checking out the Switch version. Um, this is a game that has gotten a lot of attention uh, when it first launched. A lot of people are really into it. It's a first-person shooter roguelike, so... Uh, randomly generated ships, you go around and collect uh, things that you need, like gas and food and oxygen and all that good stuff. Um, here's a map of the ship I'm about to go into. I'm looking for the FTL nozzle. That's my main point uh, in getting uh, in popping into the ship. And I don't have to get it if things go bad, but uh, that's that's the goal. Go in here and grab that nozzle. That sounded terrible. Oh, Jesus. I am not used to enemies right away. The uh, So I, I did like the tutorial, the basic tutorial, I guess. Tap, tap, tap. That means bad things, right? I'm guessing there's somebody in there. Um, so, yeah, I, uh, I played the tutorial, and I got a gist of what's going on. I was really interested in this game, and it's one of those games that just... You jerk running away. It's one of those games that I just, I thought that cloud of smoke was a bad guy. I see there's another bad guy back there. These are, these, I, these are guys I've never seen, so I'm sorry. I'm very, very nervous. Um, yeah, it's one of those games where I was like, oh, this looks like a lot of fun. I think I could really get into this. Um, can I lock this? But I just never had a chance to play it. And then before I knew it, they were like, hey, we're we're bringing it to Switch, and I was like, well, that's the perfect chance, so now I'm playing it on Switch. Um, I love the look. I really, really love the look. It's uh, cel-shaded, obviously, uh, but, you know, I feel it, it. I feel just saying it's cel-shaded does the game disservice because, you know, it's it's cel-shaded but stylized. It's like, a, uh, it's like a graphic novel. But, uh, yeah, that's what you do. You go on ships. Well, let me pay attention here. You go on ships. And you fi try and find what you need, and then you get out. Oxygen. Okay, there is oxygen on this ship if I need it. Because your oxygen goes down pretty quickly. As you can see up top, my oxygen meter is pretty... Uh, has a pretty decent chunk missing from it already. Just want to make sure that door didn't open, because there's clearly somebody in there who wants to get out. Um, you can see on the map... Opt-in to dehydration and opt-out of travel board. I don't know what this is. Add security expert. Gunpoints and peepers are shown all. Uh, no. No, I will not do that. But thank you. Um, as you can see on the map, the stars... Can I go through these? The stars show things that you want to get. I feel like... Uh, obviously, things uh, take time to to do like unlocking some doors but time is precious because you don't have a lot of time <laughs> you need to get in get your stuff and get out before you run out of oxygen or enemies might be chasing you or whatever it may be so uh yeah obviously a uh, you can see why hmm. you can see why this game has gotten a lot of attention for the look and for the i kind of want to go do this now for the look and for the gameplay loop, it's just really, it's just really interesting. Uh, and so far, hello, hello. It seems like it uh, has. Well, did, did the guy leave the room? It made the transition to switch pretty damn well. Drink tea. I don't, I don't want to. I don't know what tea does. I guess it's food. Food's good. I'm coughing because I'm running out of oxygen, which is not good. I heard you. As you might be able to tell, there's, uh, <laughs> this guy's making some funny noises. There's no motion controls as far as I know. Oh, this smoke is not helping me out. God damn it, this little man. There we go. Uh, the smoke is not helping me out. <laughs> Um, CG imposes severe penalties for self asphyxiation. Oh, well, yeah, I, I requisition supplementary oxygen in Atmo modules. Well, I was saying there's no motion controls, um, which is unfortunate. At least I don't think there are. I'll double check. Oh, 
Let me... Oh, boy. I don't have many bullets left. Get back here, dude. I can run, but I don't want to run into a situation that gets me killed. Can I? Let's do this. <laughs> boy. Re very rarely do I make decisions in games where uh, they're smart. <laughs> I think I just saved myself there. Um... So I'm not, I'm not infected with anything. I'm okay. I would imagine if I, I have some sort of uh, poison or something, I can go there and take care of my issues, but I'm okay. Where was that? Oh, I'm going to the air room. This is perfect. Maybe I should go back and get that guy. He's going to explode. Oh, well, let me do what I said I was going to do. Options. Well, oh, not graphics. Controller. Sensitivity, infra perch, acceleration, rumble, toggle on. Doesn't look like motion controls to me, which is a shame. I would love motion controls in uh, any first-person shooter. I want motion controls really. If it's on the, it's on a switch. Where is this little guy? I want to use motion controls. Is does he pop up out of this puddle? Could I shoot the puddle? You know, waste a bullet, learn something. Thought so. Well, that worked out great. I'm afraid to touch this. I bet if I touch it, I'll need to go use the purification stuff. All right, this goo is obviously not good, but there's good stuff. It's on the wall. Um, there. I'm sure I get different weapons too. Um, and I'm guessing people watching me are like. Why isn't he using iron sights when he aims? It's because iron sight isn't the button uh, you think it would be. It's uh, Well, there is none as far as this gun goes, as far as I can tell. The uh, usual iron sight button, which I would say is uh, ZL, it makes you run. Uh, but I hear things. I knew I heard things. Um... So yeah, I, I don't want to run too much because I don't want to... Oh, I didn't realize there's a timer on my oxygen. I... Uh, wait, where is it? I gotta go. I gotta go get that oxygen. Sound like there's somebody else. Oh, there's definitely somebody over there. I don't have time for this. Damn it. <laughs> this is a way to get there quicker. Are you tired of being thrown in the side of society? Therapy terminal turn thorns into roses. Ah, completely full. I gotta pay attention to that. I didn't realize there was like a timer. I was just seeing the meter that told uh, and I was like, oh you know, I got plenty of time on a meter. Seeing the actual time limit is great. Wow, what a help. Um The uh yeah, so even when you fill up, there there's probably going to be some uh, oxygen left in it. So you could you could go back and get your uh, get yourself some help. Uh, but I'd say things are going pretty well this time. Up in the corner, you can see what I'm picking up. Uh, some things are used to make new items or new weapons that you take into your next mission, and other things you. Uh, or, right, let me try this again. Some things you pick up and they're broken down into elements that let you make new items or weapons. And other things are just, you know, you use them right off the bat. You don't need to uh, build them. So I, I built something, or I have the capability to build something that's a bomb. I believe I think I throw it down. It's like a proximity mine as far as I can tell. Deposit battery. Wonderful. Get five merits for doing it. I'll do that. Merits let you do other things as well. Uh, I don't... Okay, I got the merits. I don't want to do it again. Alright, let's continue on. I uh, So here's gasoline. I can see why this game made a pretty big splash for a number of reasons. Like I said, I really like the look of it. Uh, but it's obviously going to be really addictive. Let me go grab the other gasoline. Just in case there's something waiting around the corner. Okay, so now I got the nozzle. I hear this guy talking, but I'm not listening. <laughs> I have one earbud in, so I can talk to you guys and not lose my mind. Alright, let's see. 
looks like... Oh, you know what I didn't... Damn it. Well, there's time. If you... So, I saw things on the map. Uh, like, you know, important stuff and other pieces to pick up. But... Thanks for announcing yourself, dude. <laughs> uh, there's... I'm gonna need more ammo. I don't know how you do that. Maybe you manufacture it. Um, if you get the map... Which is that grid over in the helm. Um, you can see other goodies. Man, these guys got some foul language. Not that that not that I'm upset by it, but <laughs> where is this guy? Oh, laugh it up, laugh it up, boy. He's <laughs> where are these guys coming from? All right, let me look. Through this door and into the helm. Okay, 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 okay. Oh my god. This is bad. I don't. I don't think I can uh, block those things. Or, or shoot them. I don't think I can shoot them. So I came all this way just to get this thing. Download enemy locations. No, I'm not going to do that. So now I got the map, and yes, see, if I go to the map, then I got a whole buttload of other stuff to get. The only problem is... There is. I don't have a lot of air to work with. So these four minutes are hopefully going to be my success. <laughs> Let's lock this door. Because I saw something tapping. Hello? What do I got here? I got 14 bullets left? God damn it! So there's... What? There's something... Down the end of the hallway? I d I'm not going to be able to get that. This is going to take me to a whole bunch of stuff. Alright, it looks like I'm going in and I'm going to regret it. Hello? Hello? <laughs> Alright, let's avoid something coming out of there. Nice shot. Who's in there? Anybody? 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 Alright, we're going in. This time is running out. Bullets! There we go. I don't know if I've been picking up bullets and I just didn't notice it. That's good to know. <laughs> More bullets. Well, I'm glad I came in here. Zap charges. Ah! Shoot. Now I got a problem. Okay. I jumped over it. I don't know if it just doesn't do anything or I'm just getting lucky. Well, this is going to make things complicated. I guess not. Boy, this is getting intense. I gotta watch my time for oxygen. There's something in here. Okay. I like that going to get the... Oh, boy. My health is pretty low. I am getting nervous. My health is low. I don't have a lot of time left on my oxygen. I'm pushing it. I'm pushing my luck, definitely. We're going for it. I hear bubbling. Is it that stuff? I still don't know if these splotches hurt me. Something here. Right there. Okay. Alright, I guess this is the final push. This way, right? Run across the ship. I could grab some oxygen on the way. Okay, we're going this way. I missed that one thing. That's alright. I can leave one thing behind. 
something for the next guy to come again. <laughs> I wanna, well, here's my oxygen. All right, plenty, we got plenty of time. Can I go back this way? Let's go this way. This game is super interesting and I like the pressure that it adds. Sure, take your time. It's not like I have a minute 30. Oh, hello. Two wasted shots. Uh, I'm not that, okay. Oh boy. Break room is a popular place. Man, one right at the end. All right. It worked out. We did it. I salvaged. I got a lot of good stuff. Man, that was great. Usually when I do videos, I end up doing really terrible. <laughs> All right, that's Void Bastards for the Switch. Ah, uh, it's got its hooks in me. This is really interesting. I'm very excited to see how far I can make it. And I'm sure I'll die and I'll be really sad about it because I got so much good stuff. But that's how these games go. It's a roguelike. Uh, thanks for watching, liking, subscribing, and commenting. It's very much appreciated. Also, a huge thank you to those of you who support me on Patreon. Let's me do videos like this. Uh, helps me with the site, the podcast, social media, all that good stuff. So thank you very much. I really appreciate it. If you want to learn more about uh, the Patreon, which is just a dollar, you can check out a link in the description below. But as for today, that's it. I will be back tomorrow as long as I have something interesting to show you. So until then, have a lovely day and a lovely evening. And I'll see you in a few short hours.